It used to be to make a living driving truck, you had to live in a truck. It's not that way anymore. One of my fondest memories of growing up was my dad drove a truck out of Chicago, and uh, I used to go with him, just a little boy. And I just kind of got my blood, and I've been driving ever since. When I first started, you would be gone for three, four, five weeks at a time. You got paid by the mile, by the load. So if you didn't move, you didn't get paid. We really encourage that you have your home time. I have my grandchildren, and they're one of the biggest influences in my life, and I want to spend as much time with them as I can, and I do. I have that ability to do that now and to enjoy life. My granddaughter, my oldest, she come up to me and said, Pop up, can we paint? I went and bought everything so we could sit and paint, and uh, she lost interest almost immediately. That night, I was sitting by myself, and I put a video on. I just started watching, and I just went ahead and painted a painting. My wife got up the next morning, and she still uses that painting for Christmas decoration. I'm a coach, and I train new drivers. Penske is very safety-oriented. We use Smart Drive, which I think is a great thing. Smart Drive encourages drivers to stay alert. The camera's there and triggered by an event, and it protects the driver. It can prove the driver did nothing wrong. This is a real good protection. Trucking's never gonna go away. Everything in our everyday life has been on a truck at one time. I would love to see younger drivers get into it because they've heard the stories that their fathers or their grandfathers have told, and it's not that way anymore, but they have to get in the industry to find out. I wish I had found Penske 25 years ago. I've been able to do so much more when it came to Penske because the stability is there. You can make a good career, support your family, good benefits, and still be home. My name is James Edward Blankenship, and I am a Penske driver.